Oh, no, seriously, you guys. Listen, Mike, before you became Mannix on TV, didn't you used to be a villain in the movies? Yeah, I remember that. I remember that I really, I, I, I really hated you in those movies. You know, yeah, you were always yeah. a mean guy. What I, what I mean is, well, I mean, well, you know what I mean, don't yeah, you? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Sonny, I mean, after all, you know, it's a funny thing about playing bad guys. Some of us went into television as actors, and some of us went into politics as actors. <laughs> well, hey, I got a great idea. Why don't we recreate some of the great moments of movie villainy for the folks here? Hey, that's great. Whatever you say, Sonny. I mean, let's face it, after all, it is your show. Well, uh... Half your show. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, instead of the vamps tonight, here come the villains. Oh! caught you with your camera clicking. Yeah, we know you're with the feds. And you know what we do with stool pigeons. <laughs> you don't scare me, Rocco. You show him, Mr. Preston. <laughs> I know your type. You're great with these two goons in the room. But I'd like to get you alone right here in this room, then I'd show you something. You show him, Mr. Preston. <laughs> we got a boss, don't worry. Hurry. He's Neanderthal, but we'll help him. Just leave me alone in a room with him for two minutes, boss. <laughs> you show him a thing or two. All right, goons. Get out. Show me. Well, first I'd like to show you the incision I got on my appendix off of <laughs> Then, then I'd like to show you the mole that I got here on my neck. And then you're gonna love these. I got some beautiful ties in my sample case. <laughs> A little wet cement for my friend's feet. Wet cement for my feet? Hey, gee, that's great. That must mean they're taking me to Grumman's Chinese Theater. Come on, I'll show you the way. <laughs> you, you show him, Mr. Mr. Preston. <laughs> Prisoner, mm, I am Captain Mueller of the Gestapo. Mm, this is my stick. Mm, this is my desk. Mm, sometimes I take the stick and I beat the desk. <laughs> I can be a nice guy, or I can be the rotten guy. 
Now, Captain Mueller says, relax in the... Good, good. Now put in the feet on the desk. Nein, nein, I did not say Captain Mueller says. Now, we have ways of making you talk. Elga, come and see ya. Sir, this, my dear captain, is the worst torture of the Third Reich. Ah, yeah, yeah. A Sonny Bono Sings album. Play it loud. No! No! <laughs> the whole rundown right here. All right? The Allies are going to invade here. They're going to bomb here and attack on Sunday at 4 o'clock. They have six regiments of army infantry and, <laughs> and, two, and, and a Red Cross donut mobile. No, 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 no. <laughs> Over here. Get that stuff. Is it possible to uh, get us tickets to the Bob Hope Christmas show? shall seize control of the country. Arrest the queen. I'd like to advise you of your rights. <laughs> this is a black moment for Spain. <laughs> Sir Michael, don't you know you can never hope to defeat my loyal guardsman, Sonny El Bono? El Bono? Yeah! What say you, Sir Michael? This is indeed a black day for acting. Now, well, your evil plot to gain control of the throne is over. Defend yourself! Oh! Come back, you coward! I cannot stand violence. Sir Michael, I thought you said you couldn't stand violence. Oh, it's quite all right on him, as long as it's not on me. <laughs> this is also a black day for humor. <laughs> To my brother and my sister too, and now I'm gonna give it right back to you. The days and beans in your defenses will crack. Step into my dungeon and I'll show you my wrath. He was chilling, 